Good morning team. Today I'm going to show you the use of drafting view. Drafting view basically we are using for inserting 2D sketches or 2D details into the Revit for which we have we didn't do any modeling. So as for example, you can draw into the CAD or in the image file or you can draw a 2D sketch in a Revit also. So let me start. Uh, it is a three step process. You have to create the drafting view, insert the image file or CAD file, or you can draw into uh, like a 2D details onto the drafting view and then insert that view into the sheets. So let us start with creating the drafting view. So drafting in a view, you will find in view panel, you will find a drafting view button. As for example, say two point, let us start putting the AutoCAD sheets, uh, AutoCAD elevation, uh, CAD elevation. Uh, as per example, uh, 332 second by one and give, okay. And, and go to the insert. You can use a link or import or, or, or insert from other other Revit file or whatever. So let us uh, import CAD. I have like my from profile set. As for example, I'm inserting this guy 2.01 and that whole elevation will be here. Okay. And now, so and as soon as you will create this elevation, you will find on the drafting view details that a uh, view number a uh, view name i mean uh, let us close this open now create a sheet view sheet sheet okay and say 2.01 and insert this view of the sheet into the sheet so your whole elevation is here so like that so this is this is one example of create uh, means inserting the whole sheet and the suppose uh, if you want to uh, if you have like a, some CAD a detail over the as per example say parapet cap on over the precast right so that is not a part of the model and you want to generate you want to uh, we are we, uh, the parapet cap are in our scope and if you want to draw that detail for those caps into the Revit, we can generate that detail into the cat or whatever so i will explain you how you can insert the detail so again go to the view drafting view create like a 5.01 typical seal detail that I created already in the CAD. See, this, this is an example, so you don't need to like, this is not the correct example. I have to come up with like some detail which has a parapet cap at the top, but I don't know the detail number. So, uh, like 12 into 1, okay and insert import CAD uh, like two five point zero typical cell drawing that I created so it will be here and close this create a new sheet view sheet number like say five point zero one and drop this here that's a little here you'll get the title automatically 5.0 typical cell detail 12 into 1 or whatever okay now suppose this this detail once it is in the sheet we can always call out on the elevation so let me close this and I create our own wall architecture suppose we have a Parapet wall, wall architectural. Uh, let it be. So, K 
thing and go to the elevation uh, let us start the elevation and now we can call out that as a detail by, by giving the reference or the, by referring the other view as for example we go to the detail view the detail view and i will call out this detail all right uh, sorry before calling out i have to re refer so there is not the correct way to do uh, cross detail view and then referring you have to go to the referring other detail and you have to pick up the detail which are detail it is like as for example 5.01 so the detail is here that's similar this is not so yeah it is not similar detail we don't need this text sorry 2.02 right so in that way we can insert the details that is not been uh, model so in in the same view uh, in drafting you can draw the sketches also as for example on the same view suppose if you want to draw the line and all those things create miss uh, autocad not it you can have bunch of all the tools are here so you can draw whatever uh, lines or whatever This is for, for, for the example. So this was my uh, this this is the video for inserting the 2D sketches. Thanks, guys.